Hey everyone, I'm here to show you how to install the Adobe Creative Cloud uh, onto your computer. Um, this includes Photoshop, Illustrator, Premiere, and any Adobe products, so um, you'll have access to all of that. Uh, first thing I want to note is that this cannot be installed on a Chromebook, so if you have a Chromebook, uh, please let your teacher know and uh, we will help you out in getting a Mac or a PC for you. Right. Another thing you want to do is um, you have to be the administrator of the computer. So if you have to have your administrator ID and password in all order to install this application. All right. The first thing you want to do is go to creativecloud.adobe.com. Uh, do not put the www before that. All right. And on the top right, you want to click on sign in here. And then you do not want to put your email address here. You want to skip that part and go down to continue with Google right here. All right. Next, it'll ask you for an Adobe ID uh, or enterprise ID. You want to enter an enterprise ID, company or school account. All right. And that's what you do. And then next, you want to click on Creative Cloud here. And then download the app. It's going to download. You want to open the application. All right, you can double click on the application folder and hit open. And this is where you want to enter the uh, admin password. Click on continue. And start installing. And this will take a minute, so um, I'm going to fast forward this part and we'll jump back when um, we're done installing the Creative Cloud application. All right, the installation has uh, finished, and so it's going to, another window will pop up. We'll just continue to sign in again with Google. You select the enterprise ID. Alright, now that you have the Creative Cloud application installed, you can go and go up here to your Creative Cloud app and this window will pop up and this is where you have access to all the Adobe Suite applications. As you can see, there's lots available, but for now, I will install Photoshop. You click on that, you hit continue, enter the admin password for your computer, and then you have to wait for it to install. After that, you can click and drag the application to your dock or um, create a shortcut. Right, and that's it. Good luck.